Papalia is a real classic. It's a fairy tale. It's just marvelous. It's, it's a fabulous story. The unison between the choreography and the music is excellent. It's a comical ballet. You will laugh in uh, every act. It's a joyous ballet. All that wonderful music. A sweet story of young love and jealousy and really good fun. The story of Capelia is a very sweet and simple tale, really. There's a doll maker who lives in this village. He has a special doll, Capelia, who he loves to show off and put in the balcony of his house. When Swanhilda um, sees her sitting at the window reading the book, she can't imagine or understand why Capelia isn't responding to her. Swanhilda, she's fun, she's bossy, she's curious. She's in love. She's used to probably doing this, and everybody does exactly what she wants. Swanhilda and Franz are an item. I think she's more in love with him than he is with her. Franz, he's very young, very naughty. I'm just basically being me. <laughs> he sees the Capella doll in the window, thinks it's a real girl, and starts to flirt with the doll. Swanhilda picks up on this and is very angry. The main reason is she's jealous because I'm sending kisses and flirting with Capelia. At the end of the first act, Dr. Capelia, he dropped his key and uh, Swanilda decided to go into his house and find out why I'm giving so much attention to Capelia. When the girls break in, he's so devastated that somebody has broken into his house and has disrupted his kingdom. The story is told through the dance and also through mime. You have the doll, and you have this as making, you have this as beautiful. So there are all motifs that everybody has that all are integrated within the show so that the story is told seamlessly. We all need to be downstage. Right, here we go. Like a cat. My role with Capelia is to know everything about the production, choreographically, musically, scenically, Break. because I want it to be the best it Dr. can possibly Jack be. Split. I never dance France, so right, now finally it's my everybody. debut. It's very fun and to dance. It's right. not the hardest okay. ballet for boy, but Svanilda, she's doing a lot. Can we repeat once more, Ran Rosé? Rata bure into. There's a lot of fast Go. footwork. Uh, the musicality is super precise. This role is special to me. As a kid, it was my teacher who would always choose this solo for me to do in every competition that I did as a child. I was 12 years old. My grandma used to make all my costumes and my mom would design them. Then the whole family would be running around just for me to do well. To think of that and just where I am now is just amazing. <laughs> Oh, thank you. Stay. Anything I do with Marinelle, it's always a pleasure. <laughs> Even if it's a hard ballet, she makes it look and feel much easier. It really is a highlight for me to, to dance with Vadim. Vadim, I can't stop smiling because it's just pure beauty. All the ingredients are there. And then when you get to see the set with the colors and how everybody's dressed, it's full of flavor. The great designs by Osbert Lancaster, very cleverly put together, with a little sense of humor in them, not taking themselves too seriously. I think the designs for it are exceptional. It's like this big, ginormous storybook come to life. I think it's brilliant. The choreography is excellent. It's incredibly musical. It's really stood the test of time. You dust it off and it's still as beautiful as it was originally. There are moments that are very dear and very touching. It's just very special. It's about coming in and switching off for a few hours and enjoying really being a part of this joyous world of Capelia.